Hey guys, Anders here. Welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to ask you guys for some help. Spread this video around, please, because there are some catastrophic things wrong with this game's shooting mechanics in a shooter game, and they need to be fixed because I'm tired of complaining about them. And when I show you these problems, I'm sure you will be annoyed that they aren't fixed as well if you still play this game. So, please do me a favor. I never ask this in my videos. Spread this around, you know, Twitter, Discord, whatever you want, whatever you want, right? Just please, for the love of God, I'm, I'm going I'm to try to show you these problems as clearly as I possibly can. Just try to get some developer to comment that on them or something, please, because I'm about over it. We're going to show these problems today via a crosser overlay in the center of my screen, which will represent true screen center at all times. Uh, there are some problems with this game's recoil, uh, camera syncing, animations, all, all sorts of things, and this affects every single player in the entire game, console or PC, it does not matter, and it actively affects you in gunfights sometimes, and on top of that, it affects the feeling of gunplay. So, there's a lot of things that work here, and I'm just trying to get them addressed. It's, it's a long shot, right? I'm completely aware that DICE is probably not even going to watch this video or care at all, but at least I tried. Um, so without further ado, if you enjoy the video, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel and let's just get into things. So we're going to show you guys something that I showed you before in a previous video that they quote unquote fixed, but didn't really fix fully. So pay attention to the crosser overlay that represents true screen center relative to the position of my red dot site. I'm going to show you some very funny things in this video that should not be happening. So I'm just going to shoot and pay attention to the position of those two things. That one was really bad. Did you see that? So do you see what's happening there? The center of your screen is consistently lagging behind the red dot. And then when I reach max recoil, I pull down and the screen center sort of slowly and sluggishly resets to where your red dot is all the way at the bottom. That is absolutely not how that should work. That needs to be fixed immediately, please, because that's really bad. Now, an even funnier example of this is the Glock. The Glock, when you use iron sights in, in, in semi-auto, this is the best way to show this. The animation and just the view model and the camera syncing are completely completely and totally off, which can actually cause you some problems because you might miss shots. Uh, this might affect the way you uh, feel while you play. So this one's a little bit more difficult to show, but uh, it, it will show through. I just need to spam this as fast as I can. There it is. Do you see that? Do you see that? Look how desynced that is. It's so desynced. Like, your wrist is actually above screen center at some points when you're doing this. Look at that. You know, I mean, th this is every gun in the entire game, by the way. I'll show you an even worse offender, the AK-971. Hey, I'm telling you guys right now, do not use the AK-971. I'm begging you, okay? I'll try to show you why right now. This is the worst AR in the game, I think. It, this thing is not worth it as far as you can fucking throw it. I swear to God, it's not. Uh, I'm also playing on 50 FOV, by the way, just so if anyone asks, like, why are you playing on such a zoomed FOV? To, to better show you guys the problem. It's the same on every single FOV. Um, this gun, if I can get it to do it, does it both vertically when I pull down super fast, it's desynced with the camera, and what's even worse, it does it horizontally. It's fucking awful. Let's see if I can break it. Not that time. Oh, that's not supposed to happen. Oh my God. I'll play some of these in slow motion so you guys really see how bad it is. Oh no. Ew. Just, it's just so icky. It's so icky, Dice. Please address this, okay? This, this affects you in, in gunfights, okay? This affects every single player in the entire game. Uh, and there's multiple issues at play here. Like, the Glock, I think, shows it the best. Not only is there, there recoil problems with, like, 
uh, the position of the center of your screen versus where your gun is actually like recoiling to versus camera position versus you know view model versus all this sorts of stuff right right like the animations wrong like misplaced all sorts of things are wrong and i'll try to show you guys it with a couple more weapons um the ak the horizontal one is the worst one in my opinion uh that shit is hilarious to watch the xm8 can also do it um i'll try to show you guys the horizontal with the xm8 as well it's a little harder to get it to do but it, it does it in vertical as well and i'll show you um well every single gun in the entire game does <laughs> oh no let's try to get a horizontal Oh my god. Ah. Oh. Okay, so, you guys get the point. There's something catastrophically wrong here with multiple things and it needs to be addressed. Uh one thing I could recommend to people to try to like make their lives a little easier. Obviously, if you're playing on 50 FOV, you're doing it wrong, right? Like you need to play on something else. Do not play on 50 FOV. You're just zooming into the problem sort of. Uh, play on anything other than 50 FOV at all. Um, that goes without saying. Other than that, this really is unavoidable for every single player in the entire game. Uh, and I'll just show you guys some more guns while I'm talking about this. It actually happens more often than you think if you pay attention. Like, it, it feels like you're sort of pulling through a wall of recoil or you're pulling through some sort of resistance. And that typically happens after you are done uh, bursting or something of the sort. I'll show you the Ironside AK-12, which is a fucking catastrophe. Um, this thing is totally desynced on multiple ways. Uh, bursting, sometimes it happens with as well. But the general point is you can't really have bursting meta, or whatever you want to call it, or even like functional gunplay without making sure that everything is like synced up together. Look at that. It's even desynced right off the start. Look at that. Right? I'll zoom in. It's totally desynced off the start. It gets worse and worse. And then that happens, right? It's just broken, guys. You know? It's just broken. So, you guys get the point. Thank you guys so much for watching. Really do appreciate it. Uh, like I said, I never, ever, 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 ever asked for this to happen. But spread this video around, please. I really don't mean any harm. Battlefield community. I just want the game to be fixed and to be better for everyone. And that's all I have to say. Thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. And maybe, just maybe, we can get some developers somewhere to look at this and perhaps push it up the pipeline and push a patch to actually fix or find out what's actually happening to make the game feel better. Thank you guys for watching.